microphone so this video will demonstrate how you would uh, update translations from Excel into the game and so there's a nifty tool called the unity assets bundle extractor if you uh, download the unity bundle asset extractor you can open this program and what it does is it is able to open certain files specifically the uh, config CHS so we take the most uh, updated CHS and the purpose of this will be to uh, translate this document called nurturance and so you see that there is a file inside Nurturance. You want to click Plugins. You export it to a text file. And you load it into some kind of a file. Just as a quick demonstration, you can actually export multiple files at once, which makes it much easier when you want to mass load something into the game and just as a demonstration now instead of loading in a file you choose a folder and if you click select it would load everything into the folder so now if we take a look at the location where we extracted it to notice how currently there's Chinese text and so we can go to the uh, Excel document nurturance. Uh, this one is located in the usual uh, translated Excel and then the actual document you're looking for and generally it's formatted in a way where as long as you don't copy the uh, the Chinese text to the right it's going to be okay. So pretty much you want to copy the entire nurturance document and you replace everything in the nurturance text file so now the purpose is uh, just just to double check that the nurturance text file is in English now yes it is now that you have your English translations you now want to load it back into a patch and so once again you go to your asset bundle extractor once again you make sure that it's the latest latest patch and this time we when we click nurturance we want to uh, import our English translations into the game And so you see the star that shows that there's a difference. You save it once and you have to save it twice. This time you're saving it into a specific CHS config file. And it's better to have multiple. So if anything goes wrong, you can easily go back a few steps. And so our new CHS patch is here. So before you ever release it you want to uh, do a check to make sure that you changed what you think you are changing and as always you go to the game files generally the path is similar between different computers and you go to assets bundle and you paste it in as always it's good to make a backup of whatever file you're replacing and now you renamed your new file into the original name and so it's time to test the game
So this is a save with uh, an area where I know that nurturance text is used. And well, normally there would have been icons here, and therefore there is a bug we have to fix. But overall the steps are the same, now it's time to debug it and to figure out which elements you can change, which elements you can't change. And yeah, that's